Radiation treatments are used as an adjunct or a local therapy for treating breast cancer. It's used for virtually all patients who have had a lumpectomy, a breast conservation surgical procedure. It's also used for selected patients who've had a mastectomy for indications such as nodal involvement or very bulky tumors or involvement of adjacent structures like the chest wall or the skin. In a few instances, we use it before surgery. That's uncommon, but that might be done if someone had a very bulky, locally advanced tumor that was involving some of the structures in the area so it wasn't technically resectable. That usually is managed with drug therapies first to try and shrink the tumors down to the point that surgery becomes feasible. If that's not successful, then sometimes we use radiation to further try and shrink it down, get the tumor to let go of those adjacent structures. The course of treatment is a few minutes each day, and that's given over a number of weeks typically. The most common schedules would be three to four weeks or five to six weeks. The reason it's given over an extended period of time isn't to make it more effective at killing tumor cells. We could give a single big dose of radiation. We could kill cancer cells very effectively. The reason we use the protracted schedules is because a small dose of radiation every day keeps knocking the tumor cells down. But if we go slow enough, the normal cells can repair much of the radiation damage. So by the time we get to the end of a course of treatment, hopefully we've eradicated any cancer cells in the area, but the normal tissues are in good condition. A lot of different things have been tried. The groups have been defined as very small tumors, very low-grade tumors. They've looked at, at age criteria. And we really only have one group that has come out of all of these trials quite recently as a group that probably doesn't need the radiation afterward. And that's women who are over age 70, who have strongly ERPR positive tumors, who are going to be on some form of endocrine therapy like tamoxifen or perhaps Arimidex. And for those women, because breast cancer is more indolent, it's less aggressive if it occurs later in life, their risk of a recurrence with a small tumor is probably low enough just with the surgery.